this is a common condition that we see and the patient presents with bumps on the on the face and it actually can occur from here right down to the upper chest and these are little skin lesions uh, the diagnosis is dermatosis papillosa nigra so what should the patient know uh, these happen in patients who are darker skin they're more prone to it and um, as they these lesions grow bigger as well as a patient gets older and if sometimes if uh, neglected they can turn into little small skin tags so the treatment is actually quite simple using a, a radio frequency device rather than lasers and other freezing so radio frequency device is very accurate uh, it hurts a little bit and after doing a session it does uh, they do come back sorry or they patients will grow more uh, over a period of time so we require treatment maybe once a year or something once after it's been all cleaned up uh, the treatment itself is has no risk of scarring uh, because it's only superficial these lesions are mainly in the epidermis which is the outer layer of the skin but in darker skin patients it is uh, there is a risk of PIH or post inflammatory hyperpigmentation so we often combine it with a uh, whitening cream or something tyrosinase inhibitor so to reduce the uh, chances of PIH and it aids in recovery uh, depending on how many uh, lesions there are usually one treatment will finish will cover about 80 90 percent of all the lesions and then the patient will come back again and say oh i've missed this or or i've missed certain lesions these need to be uh, repeated treatment so usually about two to three treatment will clean it all up and then maybe um, in a year's time they come back with minor lesions and we continue again it is not a good idea to leave these lesions too late because they get bigger and it is more painful if it is uh, getting bigger we do apply local anesthetic cream before the treatment. Uh, I myself have two lesions here and I get it cleaned up every, every year or so. Um, after the treatment, there should be a little scab and then it falls off uh, after five to seven days, leaving to no scar. As you can see, some patients have it very, very close to the eyes. Is that a problem? Uh, no, it's not a problem. And these can be easily treated again with uh, radio frequency device.